Our scripture reading this evening comes from the letter to the Hebrews. Tonight we're in chapter 12, looking at verses 3 to 13. There's much to unpack in these verses. We won't be exhausting it tonight, but we'll be looking at this text in its first part as it reveals to us the theme of the discipline of Christ. But we'll read the whole section. We might have the context before us. Again, we'll begin our reading in Hebrews 12, verse 3. And as you turn there and prepare to hear the Word of God read, I remind you that this is not merely the words of a man, but indeed the inspired, infallible, and inerrant words of God. Hebrews 12, verse 3. Consider him who endured from sinners such hostility against himself, so that you may not grow weary or faint-hearted. In your struggle against sin, you have not yet resisted to the point of shedding your blood. And have you forgotten the exhortation that addresses you as sons? My son, do not, lightly, do not regard lightly the discipline of the Lord, nor be weary when reproved by him. For the Lord disciplines the one he loves and chastises every son whom he receives. It is for discipline that you have to endure. God is treating you as sons. For what son is there whom his father does not discipline? If you are left without discipline, in which we have all participated, then you are illegitimate children and not sons. Besides this, we have had earthly fathers who disciplined us, and we respected them. Shall we not much more be subject to the Father of spirits and live? For they disciplined us for a short time, as seemed best. 